Hi, everyone. Welcome back to another episode of the Micro Podcast on Podcasting. And today we are talking about those beautiful podcast hosting platforms, those beautiful institutions that make sure that your podcast is delivered to Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Pandora, Amazon, Google. You need a podcast host, and we're going to be talking about the best ones for you in this episode today. Okay, so we're going to start off with the number one, my favorite podcast host in the whole wide world. It is something that I have used since the very beginning, and I tell each and every one of my podcast coaching clients that this is the podcast host that I really, really recommend. Number one, it's super easy. It is so simple to use. Number two, it is extremely affordable, and they offer a free plan with limited storage so that you can at least try it out and you can see how it works. The company that I'm talking about, the platform that I'm talking about, of course, is Podbean. Podbean is my number one most preferred podcast hosting platform in the world. And it is the one that I recommend to all of my clients. Again, I use it because it's easy. I've been using it for several years now. And that is the one that I suggest. I'm going to include the link to Podbean here so that you can also get a free trial. I'll include it in the show notes of this program so you can check it out. But it is my absolute favorite podcast host. The second most favorite, and actually when I first started out, it was a toss up between Podbean and Libsyn. And I was like, ah, I like Podbean, but I also like Libsyn. I like many of the qualities that Libsyn has. It is a beautiful program. And again, super easy to use, but high quality. In other words, you can rely on it and it's extremely affordable as well. Libsyn was my second choice. I went with Podbean, but Libsyn is a really great option if you like. They offer monetary monetization options, detailed analytics, and so much more. Again, there's a link to Libsyn in the show notes. Another popular podcast hosting platform. Oh, say that three times fast. Another one is Buzzsprout. And Buzzsprout has actually a really great thriving community. It's easy to use, and it has really good reviews across the board. And if you're just getting started in podcasting, Buzzsprout seems to have a very easy to use navigation system and it's embeddable podcast player is super easy to use and looks great on all screen sizes. And if you don't have a website for your podcast, don't worry, Buzzsprout will provide you one. There's details on Buzzsprout in the show notes as with all the other podcast platforms I've been talking about. Another possible option you might want to check out is SoundCloud. Now, SoundCloud is great as a free program, but it's up to three hours that it's free. So anything after that, you're going to have to pay a little bit. And of course, if you're podcasting, you want to have more than three hours unless you're doing a micro podcast like this. I still prefer Podbean as my first choice. My second choice would be Libsyn. My third choice would be Buzzsprout. And my fourth choice would be SoundCloud. But it's an option for you to check out. Again, you want to go with what feels best for you. And no matter what podcast host you choose for your show, make sure it's something that is number one, it's affordable for you. Number two, it's easy to use. Easy smeezy is the way to go. This is what I teach every single client. Please pick something that works with you, works with your budget, but is easy for you to use. You do not want to struggle when you're beginning your podcast. You don't want to struggle figuring out how to upload your shows. You want it to be easy, navigation to be easy, and tracking of your statistics to be easy peasy. That's right. I said it. Easy peasy. Well, that's all we have time for today. So make sure you check out the show notes if you want to have links to any of these podcast hosting platforms. Many of them are free to try out. Now, one word of caution before you do anything, before you sign up with anybody. Remember, if you have a podcast host who says that it's free, free, free all the time, remember that nothing is truly ever free. Be careful. There are those podcast hosting platforms that make it extremely tasty for you to post your show on them, but they end up having all the statistics. 
please do your homework. Please read the small print. So many people come to me and say, what do I do now? All my shows are on this podcast hosting platform that was free. And now I can't get my shows. I can't get the MP3s. I can't download them. They're all in this system. And all the statistics from Apple and everything is going to that third party. Do your homework. Make sure you have as much control and ownership of your show as possible. That's why I recommend to all my clients to go to Podbean. It's straightforward. It's easy. It's affordable. And I think you'll get the idea. Again, if you want to check out any of the podcast hosting platforms that I've been mentioning in this micro podcast, you can just check out the show notes. And until next time, thank you so much for checking out another edition of the micro podcast on podcasting. Thank you.